The summer of 2011 has been a hot one so far. Forget water country, come and cool off and enjoy the crystal cool water of the mini pool. Get there early because you want to stay all day. Well, the Manning Pool opened uh, four years ago, and the, the building department is responsible for the maintenance of the pool. We run it with a gentleman from public property. All the people who are responsible for maintaining the safety here and the water clarity are all CPO, they're all certified pool operators, certified by the state. When we come here in the springtime, there's all kinds of leaves and stuff in the pool, so we have to start a month before the pool opens, we're here working on it. We have to get the filter, make sure the filter system's up and running and that the motors are operating correctly. And on a daily basis, they'll come in here in the morning, hours before the pool opens, and make sure that it's vacuumed and clean, that the water's clear, that the pH and chlorine balance correctly. And, um, they're here every day and they test the water four to five times a day throughout the course of the day. Yeah, we're having fun at the Manning Pool. We have to test the water four times a day. That's the, that's the state code. Um, water clarity is the number one issue. Um, the chlorine levels and the pH levels are uh, the most critical when you're testing the water. But the water clarity is the, the most critical part of uh, this pool safety so the lifeguards can always see what's going on in the pool. And this is known as a zero entry pool, which means you can walk in the water as if you're at the beach. So you can walk right in without going down any steps and eventually get into the deeper end of the pool. Really a nice facility the state built four years ago, handed it over to the city. All the chairs are always filled, there's always a lifeguard on duty. I think we have eight here on a daily basis and six are on while two might be off and, and they they rotate that way? Well, we start, uh, try to set up the first chair and we just work our way around and more people come in. We keep it to a minimum because we don't want it to get too packed and just prevent any bad incidents, help everybody out, you know, not just, you know, for people drowning, people get hurt, uh, first aid too, you know, people get hurt on the playgrounds, kids, and even if it's not anything that major, uh, we can help people out. Well, really just common sense when you're in a pool, you know, for your own safety. You know, we don't always need to tell everybody what to do. We're not there to, uh, you know, make anyone's day boring or keep them from having fun. It's just for safety, you know, their, their own personal safety. To be careful where you run, you know, slipping. and People know what's dangerous and what isn't. There's a couple of kids from the mayor's office. One will watch the slide area. Another one will stay over in this area and we're always watching the kids and make sure they don't run and no one gets hurt. We want everybody to have fun here, we don't want any accidents. I live for the pool in the summer. I teach in the winter and I look forward to just jumping in the pool. I prefer pools over lakes. Um, they're much cleaner, much more visible to the eye if someone is in trouble. Take notice of uh, the beautiful shade areas that we provide. We have a nice play area over there that has a recycled rubber matting underneath, really safe. Nice grassy areas, there's a nice concession stand here, and there's actually quite a bit more to do than just jump in the water, and we hope all the citizens in Brock can come out and uh, enjoy it. When I was a kid, there were three pools in the city, and then by the time I was a teenager, we actually had four pools in the city. We had the Montello, the Campello, the Cosgrove, which is still open, and we had a, the old Manning Pool here. Being in the sun, it's nice. We buy a pool for the summer, it's great, you know, good people, it's nice. Jumping in on a hot day like this when it's 90, and it's the life. You, you go on vacation, and this is what you do on vacation, you jump in the water, so it's very affordable. It's open for public swimming from uh, one to six every day. Come to the Manning Pool, so, uh, have a nice day here, enjoy it.